Today we're showing you guys the top five ways of making money in GTA 5 Online. So if you guys are poor, you're looking at ways to make money in the future, bada boom, bada bing, you click on the right video. Because today I'm showing you guys the top five ways of making money in GTA 5 Online. Now right here, this is very important. Make sure you guys listen to this part right here. If you guys are on PS4, change your MTU settings to 700. And if you're on Xbox One, you guys are in a public session, there's people in there. Just test your not tight settings and you guys should get a public session all by yourself. That is very important for this video right here because you guys are going to need some public sessions all by yourselves and make a whole bunch of money. Because this is pretty much solo making money in GTA 5 Online. First method I love of making money in GTA Online is simple as this. is having yourself a nightclub. Now if you guys actually yourself did, but I don't want a nightclub. But guess what? This nightclub takes all your gosh darn little freaking businesses around the map. It puts it into one whole thing. I said, you know what? I got some stock right here in my nightclub. Let's see how much stock I got here. Whoa, bas almost, basically a million dollars. I got just chilling there. Literally, this is just your side money right here. It's just, just chilling right there. I recommend if you guys don't have a nightclub right now, bada boom, bada bing, save up for it. Because you're eventually going to forget about your nightclub and you come into it one day and boom, you got like a million dollars just chilling there now these missions here are very simple once you guys have a solo public session all by yourself these missions here are by far the most easiest missions you're ever going to do in gta online i swear i put this one first because i love this one the most because you guys can make a whole bunch of money from all your businesses in one with your nightclub look at this simple missions just dropping off the little packages bada boom bada bing and sometimes you get merry weather popping up you can take them out easily you're you're a trained player you know what to do so right there i just made the most easiest money they're probably ever going to make in gta online the guy took some cuts so i got 877 000 right there just all for my businesses together in a nightclub it's duh, it's a tasty time to be alive the next one here we have special cargo now I love this one right here especially when it's double money and RP when it says double money and RP I recommend taking a hold of this but you guys can make a whole bunch of money right there we get some crates sometimes you guys will get a special crate those babies sell for a lot of money but they're kind of rare so I did all my missions right here I have a total of 126,000 I said you know what I'm gonna sell this and this mission right here I literally just gotta drop off one package and I just make it just a hundred thousand dollars plus wow isn't that look at it so damn easy I recommend getting yourself guys a little warehouse get your car cargo missions in because when that's double money in RP that would have been close to $300,000. Now onto the third one, we have vehicle cargo. Now I recommend get yourself one of those little warehouses for your vehicle cargos because you guys can make a whole bunch of money, especially just like the last one when it's double money RP. But I look for the top range cars. You guys want to get the top range cars and just bring it back to your little gay garage and you're doing tremendous things in life. Also, pro tip right here, if it's a solo public session just like myself, there's going to be NPCs popping up. That's why I got my cargo bob on dial so I can take this baby up in the air and totally avoid the all NPCs. Another pro tip, if you guys are in the lobby with your friend and he happens to be another CEO, and you're only two players in there, you're a CEO and he's a CEO, you can literally don't need a cargo bob. You just need to tell him, hey, just don't touch my stuff. And you guys have no NPCs. The only person you gotta worry about is your friend. But that's an easier way to do it without a cargo bob. But I have a total public session all by myself. So I said I had the cargo bob. Let's do it. Make sure you guys Pretty go good out. hype because the NPCs could pop up randomly and start clack clack clapping you. You don't want that. So I just sold my car for $100,000 right here. That was a top range car. That's a car you guys wanna get. Guys, this is some tasty stuff we got going on here. You, you gotta believe me. This is tremendous. $100,000 dollars you can't go wrong now this one here I love this one here when you guys have yourself a little bunker I recommend selling it to the highest bidder that happens to be Los Santos for me you guys might just get some haggard missions where there's two trucks and stuff like this here but there's a nice tasty mission where you guys just get in one blue truck just like this and you guys are just smooth sailing nobody's in this lobby it's just you you're gonna do tremendous things here you can see right here only thing you gotta worry about is these cops the cops are nothing I just sold my bunker stuff right here for a good amount of money if you guys do do this in a public session with more people I believe you guys do get a little bit more money but hey we're doing this solo we just got three hundred thousand dollars for literally just driving a truck from here to there it's a tremendous time now for the final step of making some money in GTA 5 online, I recommend doing the heist with your friend. Now if you guys don't have yourself an arcade, you don't have anything I showed you guys in the video, I recommend doing the heist with your friend. Say, hey dude, give me 85% of the cut because your friend's probably a millionaire or something like that, or even a billionaire. But if you guys did make it this far in this video, make sure to write in the comments below the letter F because I will heart every one of those comments because you, my boy, you was a true MVP and I would sure as hell notice you. Now I like the gold mission for the heist because you guys do get a lot of money for this if you guys have more people, but if you guys have, you know, just you and your friend to so, hey dude just give me the most money so you guys can do everything else in this video you guys can eventually get your bunker your nightclub and stuff like this i recommend just doing this whole bunch of times with your friend and you guys can make some good amount of money just tell your friend to give yourself 85 percent of the cut or you give him 85 percent you know we're trying to share stuff here that's what we're trying to do here for the first time completing this heist though you guys do get some more money as well i didn't have it recorded but you guys will gain an extra maybe 200 and maybe 300 thousand dollars i'm not sure what it is but you guys usually get like 200 to 150 thousand dollars when you guys first complete the first heist and stuff like that so every heist you 
guys are going to get a little bit more additional money at the end of it. So right here, my boys, this is the top ways of making money in GTA 5 Online. If you guys are a beginner in GTA 5 Online, click on this video right here. It's going to show you guys the tremendous ways to start out in GTA 5 Online.